He's testified once before on behalf of defense in the trial against accused murderer Alan Agababa. Based on what I see, um, uh, I, I would go undetermined with the manner of death. Um, and uh, admitting that I couldn't tell the difference between uh, a homicide and an accident. Based on what I've seen. His name is Dr. Joseph Cohen, a forensic pathologist based out of California. According to KUAM Files, Dr. Cohen, via Skype, disagreed with the government's expert witness on how Shelley Bernstein died. I find it peculiar that a single uh, impact to the head is, uh, is connected to um, uh, this type of um, homicide scenario. While Guam's chief medical examiner, Dr. Aurelio Espinola, determined Bernstein died from blunt force trauma to the head and the manner of death, a homicide, Dr. Cohen concluded she died from acute combined prescription drug intoxication and blunt impact to the head with scalp injury and hemorrhage. As for the manner of death, Dr. Cohen doesn't agree it was a homicide, but instead testified it was undetermined, proposing an accidental fall. Because Bernstein used prescription steroids, which over time soften bones, it wouldn't take much force to damage her skull. But will Cohen return for Agababa's defense in the upcoming retrial? Not if the government's motion to suppress Cohen's testimony, which was filed late last week, is granted by the court. For the upcoming trial, Agababa can't afford Cohen's services and may resort to using transcript, video, or an audio replay of Cohen's past testimony. The government argues the admission of such testimony would be hearsay, as they wouldn't be able to engage in cross-examination beyond what was conducted in the past trial. Quote, Dr. Cohen's research and testimony into this case was purchased by defendant, end quote. The government further argues, quote, defendant has failed to show that he was unable to procure an expert of similar qualifications, despite receiving an award which the court deemed appropriate of indigent funds for that explicit purpose. Further, defendant has not shown that Dr. Cohen's testimony is unique and could not be reproduced by another pathologist or similar expert, end quote. Agababa, as we reported, is accused of killing his mother to collect her death benefits. KUAM files show no murder weapon was ever recovered. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Crystal Paco.